Do not listen to this recording whilst driving or whilst operating machinery. Only listen when you can safely relax and bring your full awareness to your own complete comfort. Hello, this is Michael Seeley welcoming you to this hypnosis session, which I have created for you to use for your own self-healing, meditation and personal development as you seek to reconnect to your inner child state. The idea of the inner child can be considered to be that important part within all of us which originated with our birth and then continued on until our transition into adulthood and beyond. Very quickly, this part of us first learned how to perceive, how to sense, how to listen, how to think, how to react and behave, and especially how to feel as we formed the original blueprints for our older adult selves. For most people, how your inner child experienced the world early on in your developing years no doubt continues to have at least some effect on who you are right now. And for those who did not have the perfect childhood, which, let's face it, is most likely all of us in some way or another, or for those who may have suffered undue emotional or physical abuses, this following process encourages the giving of your own adult self's understanding, self-love and self-acceptance back to your younger and more innocent being, as well as remembering just how much your inner child has to offer back to you in return. Many people find that this experience can become a powerful step in the journey towards a positive life transformation and for resolving many current problems or issues in one's contemporary life. However, if you do know that you have had a particularly traumatic childhood and would rather avoid stirring up any possible deeper feelings or memories, then I suggest you do not listen to this recording. Instead, I would suggest that your healing is best achieved by working in conjunction with a private therapist. If you know you are comfortable, though, with these ideas, you are confident with hypnosis and ready to proceed, then please continue by knowing that you are always the one who remains in control. All hypnosis is self-hypnosis, and my voice is simply a guide. At any time during this session you are always free to stop listening, open your eyes, or to recommence doing as you wish. Now my ultimate hope and wish for you, as you begin to make your preparations to best listen and relax, is that you may create and enjoy your very best, empowered and happiest life. So, as we begin, please position yourself for your comfort and focus. And you may shut down your eyes just as soon as you choose. Take a moment to silently set all of your positive intentions for this session. Reminding yourself that this is your time to orient to a more internal communication. Developing that dialogue which you can enjoy between your conscious awareness and your subconscious, deeper self. Now whether you are sitting or lying down as you are hearing my voice, I'd like you to tune in just a little more to your own physical sensations. which already know how to best and easily relax you, knowing that this comfortable time here is time just for you and you alone, a time to more easily bring about 
those subtle changes. Changes which you may notice now or over time as you successfully create so many new thoughts and new behaviours and new feelings. And isn't it interesting to allow your conscious awareness to shift in this pleasant way as easily as bringing your attention now to the rise and fall of your chest. Noticing the gentle passing of each breath. As your relaxing thinking self orients into the presence of the present. And notice any sensations of that gliding air as healthy oxygen moves softly into your nose and your throat. And notice too the temperatures of that air as you inhale and exhale. slowly becoming aware of the warmth or coolness that flows and changes from moment to moment and now into then. Breathing down always just a little deeper into your lungs. Allowing each breath to calm you so much more as you release your diaphragm and lower stomach so that on every out-breath you consciously choose to release all physical and also all non-physical tensions. Softening, loosening, unwinding, just letting go. And some people find it pleasantly curious to just enjoy the conscious mind remaining wakeful, safely and quietly continuing to observe whilst your unconscious mind listens allowing the sounds of my words to become now just like your words. Trusting in your interior voice to guide you into deeper states of blissful and complete calmness, where you can remember that the benefits of hypnosis are usually best achieved. Now, a wise person once described this journey of returning to our inner child self as like a familiar sense of homecoming, a transforming voyage within, along the internal roads, pathways and passages of your own incredible mind and spirit. And maybe there is a part of you which is already ahead now. A part of you already moving forwards, peacefully along your beautiful trek. Quietly powered and reassured by the gentle wonders of your deepest imagination. So how good would it feel, you can wonder, to truly follow your own special and unique life's map? Are there lights, you might imagine, shining beacons here to guide your way?
or do you take heed of those soft-sounding calls, knowing in your heart of hearts that so many opportunities are really available to you, simply by trusting your unconscious self to lead you into the incredible spaces of this inner peace. Deeper and deeper down. You know that this is all it takes. Enjoying whatever stairways or pathways or gentle sloping valleys may now come to you on your way whilst you are moving so easily down to those deeper depths below. Now I'd like you to imagine in your mind a secret space, a space just for you, a little closer ahead, hearing, feeling, seeing, sensing or knowing. It really doesn't matter how you might experience this place, because the sublime sights and sounds of your inner world arrive to you without any of those everyday concerns. As all former worries and earthbound responsibilities from way back there, they're just floating out and away now, like magnificent colours from you. And some way back there, perhaps in a resting distance behind, you can still feel your body sinking and softening a little further beneath you. And maybe you smile to yourself as you glance back through those white mists to see those body limbs lengthening and softening, letting go even more those heavier arms growing longer and looser. Or those lighter feeling hands and fingers becoming so free. As your body's waist and hips release and let go, as thighs and knees unlock and relax all the way down through shins and the ankles, there is always so much to enjoy in these feelings, just like familiar sounding echoes or waves, as other parts of you continue to find a more comfortable distance, allowing you right now to drift. Now the true journey towards your inner child self starts here, as I'd like you to imagine yourself as something just like a single, natural, green leaf. Just a simple leaf from perhaps your favourite tree. A leaf which easily detaches from an equally beautiful outstretching branch. And now can you follow that leaf, as maybe you can imagine or feel or see it gliding down, softly and calmly, as it floats so gently down through the air, and down, and down. You are also enjoying this soaring, this sense of floating, always stretching down, so much 
further down into so many, many deeper roots below. Now calmly your leaf and you along with it are descending into the gentle eddies of what you now see is a clear mountain water stream. And as the slow currents of the waters begin to carry you and support you now further and further down the tranquil flowing estuaries. You find yourself swept along in this way, feeling perhaps now better than you have ever felt before. And always you know you are moving to somewhere so very important inside of you. Until finally, you do come to rest at a large, calm crystal pool. And you find yourself somewhere at the base of an enormous, overlooking mountain. And soon you find yourself stepping out and onto such majestic shores. Shores which open up to reveal now a large and spacious clearing. Now as you continue to relax so deeply, and yet you are hearing every word I say, an entirely new sense of even deeper serenity and healing feels into you. As you begin to notice shimmers and subtle sounds of new images and new tones, in the air around you. Because new flashes and sparks and notes of ideas and emotions, all of these are materializing into very small spheres, just like magical floating silver bubbles, bubbles of information and time, which form and shine back to you as they hang in the air, just waiting for you to notice their songs like individual globes of tiny singing starlights. And very soon, as you begin to approach each tiny star, you start to see so many wonderful reflections contained within each spark. As flashes and moments from your own life, scenes from your very own memories, begin to play out and take shape and sound, before your awareness. And now as you continue to step gently through your space, you find yourself smiling within at each recognition, because you realize now your deeper self is showing to you right here all of those very important scenes and moments which have helped you grow and become the very person that you currently are. One by one, you glance upon each memory.
and even as you do, you feel you are gaining much more insight into yourself. Much more understanding of your own behaviours, your own impulses, your own habits and reactions, because you are journeying even further beyond your conscious mind's memories. Always feeling calm and secure, you are so safe in this world, because you also sense a special field of protective healing energy moving with you and about you like an aura, as strength and security, calmness and control, confidence and self-trust, and a quiet, curious observation. All of these qualities are growing and growing within you. So much so that if you choose it now, you realize you can allow yourself to even reach out and touch any scene there from your past that you wish to examine in a closer detail. Knowing that new and profound meanings are awaiting you because you are learning here to finally heal your deepest self. Now as you continue on, you find and feel your fingers reaching softly to touch many different scenes. Always protected and calm as your unconscious replays more and more observations and understandings from back there in those earlier years. Very soon, and even deeper within you, you feel such a powerful need to move towards one scene or one memory now in particular. Because there is that part of you that is drawn to that moment, that initial learning experience. And you know there is that one particular scene where the most powerful and the deepest of all understandings will eventually and safely reveal to you part of you that represents your inner child self. And now soon... You will hear my voice count down from five to one. And as it does, you will see and feel yourself reaching out to touch that special soft silver texture of that one very special and specific floating reflection. And as you do, just trust and allow your unconscious to guide you wherever it will, accepting where you will travel. And when I reach the count of one, you will find yourself absorbed into that specific scene or memory, present and aware and face to face with your own inner child. Now, five, four, three, two, and one. Now all of your mind's senses are opening and you feel yourself drawn into that silver light. And now you are emerging into this past memory and right here in front of you, that's right, now you see 
you are here in the company of your inner child self. And take this moment to witness all of your surroundings. Notice directly where you are in this moment and memory in time. And notice where your inner child is and how he or she now looks. Notice how does your inner child represent themselves to you. Are they an infant or a toddler or a few years older perhaps? Or do they appear as a young adolescent or teenager? How is it they are dressed? And just accept however your inner child chooses to show themselves to you. And take this time to thank and honour your inner child for appearing here in your presence. And know that even if there is not a face or a physical form that you see, but instead a more abstract symbol or a feeling or a different image or sound, then know that this is also perfectly fine because your inner child is choosing to show themselves to you in their authentic and truest form. Now you know the very next step is to acknowledge and thank everything that your inner child has done for you in your life because even now they are continuing to do such an important job there inside of you, being the ultimate keepers of all of your innocence, your youthful joy and your powerful vitality. And now look closer upon the face or symbol of your inner child self. And gaze deeply, if you can, into his or her eyes. What is the expression there that you really see? What sense of emotion can you feel behind those eyes of your younger self? and make contact with your inner child now by reaching out to them as an absolutely true friend. And understand that your inner child may need you very much so right now, because you are the one that your inner child trusts most of all in this entire world. You are the greatest strength of understanding, of compassion, of reassurance and soothing comfort to your younger self. So tell your child directly now that he or she is such a good boy or girl. Tell them that you really do understand how he or she has always done their very best. Let them know directly that you are so very proud of them 
and that everything will be okay. Tell them you are so incredibly proud of everything they have learned, everything they have experienced, and everything they have endured. Because truly, and deepest down, you honour them and respect them. Tell them all of this, and even more, in your own special way, and let them know, really let them know, however you can, that so many of the things they experienced were never their choice. Now comfort your inner child if needed and as best you can. Or if appropriate for you, you may share now in their joy or their playtime or their current adventure. And if that means reaching out to touch or hold, then do that right now, always letting them know that the ways of the world were so often beyond their control. And yet still, you know they brought their wonderful naivety, their energy and their youthful heart to everything that they did and everything that they do. Now I want you to listen, to really listen with your adult self. Listen closely to your inner child, because you may hear a very soft voice there whispering back to you. It may take some time for this voice to appear, or it may happen right now. But you know there is a voice to be heard there, an incredibly important voice with so much to offer. So listen carefully to anything and everything that your inner child may wish to communicate directly to you. Now, if you wish and you feel it is appropriate, you may ask your inner child a question or a series of questions. And the first question may be, what is it that I can do to make you feel how you truly wish to feel? Or what can I do to make you feel better? What is it you need now most of all? What 
else do you truly need me to know? Now in your own time, you may now ask any other important questions you have for your inner child, anything at all that you wish to know from your younger self, as you discover they really do have such a universal wisdom beyond their years. Now reassure and let your child know that you have received and heard every expression they have shared with you. And let your child know that everything to do with their future is going to be all right. And you know this because you, as an adult, you have survived. You, as an adult, you have overcome so many obstacles. You, as an adult, have passed challenges that perhaps your younger self was too frightened or too nervous or too shy to imagine, and yet you did overcome them all. You did survive and thrive. And let your inner child know that you, as an adult, you are always here for your child. and go ahead and share with them every bit now of your adult wisdom, your adult knowledge, your wise courage, your grown-up confidence, and your worldly strength. Let them know that you are here to protect them in all ways, from this moment onwards, you are here for them in each and every way. Now you know, and your inner child knows, that you are the true champion for your younger self. From this day forwards, you know with all parts of you that you will honour, cherish and respect their deepest wishes. And you know you may return to visit again and spend even more time with your inner child self, because the two of you are one and the same. And you realise deeply within that your dual energies and your shared experiences make up the entirety of who you truly are. Now as you begin to make preparations for your goodbyes, let your heart first fill with all of your love. Let yourself fill up now with the greatest sense of your total love and acceptance. As this total acceptance fills into you and from you, acceptance for what you both have experienced, 
acceptance for what you have faced together. And acceptance here for every new insight and powerful understanding you have both learned and shared. Letting your deepest heart share every powerful part of your loving self. Delivering now the gift of absolute acceptance to your inner child. Now look upon your inner child for one last time in this visit and truly see that they have received the very best of your love and understanding. And maybe your inner child will reach out to you now and share with you a very special parting gift. Perhaps a final thought, or image, or symbol, or sound, or feeling. Whatever they may have for you, allow yourself to accept this most special token. And let that gift shrink down now so that it fits just into the palm of your hand and feel your loving fingers wrapping around this special gift, embracing all of its energy as you move your hand slowly to your chest, and simply let that powerful gift flow directly into your heart, where you know that it now lives deeply inside of you forever and ever. Now it is time to say your goodbye to your inner child. Let that healing energy pass between you, sealing and joining you forever. As you begin now to float up and away from this special meeting place, all the time knowing you may return again whenever you choose, as easily as taking the time to listen to this recording. But for now, all of your love and all of your warmth carries you back through those floating reflections. Back and back through that wide open clearing. As the waterways carry you back up that clear crystal stream. And now through the very roots of that beautiful tree and you find yourself emerging out into those wonderful branches where all of the leaves are now whispering softly to you, singing with so many new messages of positivity and hope and joy. Because you know now that every day forth from this moment, you are a much, much calmer person. Every day forth, you are feeling so much more in self-control. Every day and every evening from this moment, you have so much more happiness and enthusiasm for life within you. Because you have found now something so wonderful within yourself once again. You are reconnecting now to your youthful energy and vitality. Your life is opening with every possibility as all options are clearing before you because inside of you there is now that quiet humming voice once again always guiding you and reminding you to be the most authentic and the most real person that you have always wished to be.
Now if you are intending to sleep here, as you drift off into your bedtime, then you may let your awareness relax even more. Simply ignoring or turning off the remainder of this recording as you find yourself enjoying a refreshing and healing night's sleep. Waking tomorrow or when you do, to find you have so much more natural energy as all parts of you will be renewed and refreshed in every way. But if you are planning to get up and continue on with your day or evening, then just keep listening. And in a moment, I will count upwards from one to five. And when I say five, you will open your eyes and return back to your fully alert, conscious awareness, feeling in every way healthy, integrated, and wholly revitalized, hopeful and positive for your very best present and future. Now, one, slowly, easily and calmly, coming up towards your full awareness. Two, each muscle and nerve in your body is loose and relaxed, and you are feeling wonderfully good. Three, from head to toe you feel perfect in every way, breathing in a deeper breath now. And four, your eyes are feeling cool, calm, clear and relaxed, as though they have been bathed in fresh spring water. And on the next number I say you will open your eyes wide, coming back to your complete, alert, conscious awareness, feeling refreshed and revived. Now five, eyes wide open, fully aware, taking in a good, deep breath, and maybe you'd like to stretch and smile to yourself. And thank you for listening. My best wishes for your increasing health and harmony, as you have now successfully focused the power of your own mind's best intentions. Talk to you soon.